Here's the first step of if your bird flies away. Act quickly if a bird escapes. <laughs> That's good advice. <laughs> don't slow down when your bird leaves. <laughs> don't, don't don't put everything on. A... <laughs> Make sure you you don't use up all your energy. Yeah, don't go about your day if your bird escapes. You're not gonna want to. You're gonna want to. <laughs> I want a, to a trip to Jamba Juice if your birds. <laughs> I wish Kevin wasn't working for the Valley folk right now, so he could make a video. Out of this. So I he could make to, our show better. Because I'd love to see a guy like watch his bird fly out the window and then just like slowly turn around and start to like walk <laughs> to, to go get his bird. And uh, Andy, no. That's the bird's name. Is Andy? Andy, Sam. no. Andy, no. Damn it. Timing is critical. You must act. <laughs> <laughs> Ti- listen to this sentence, Mike. <laughs> Timing is critical when you're dealing with a flyaway pet bird. <laughs> you must act the moment that you discover your bird is missing to have the best possible chances of recovery. You got to be fast if you want to catch a bird. <laughs> <laughs> We're talking Superman like. You got to get. You- listen, if you see your bird fly out the window. No, most important step <laughs> is to the second you see that happen is to do something. <laughs> if you want to, if you want to get him back, you're gonna want it. Doesn't really matter what you do, <laughs> as long as he's as fast. Because <laughs> that's gonna be the best, the best possible chance of recovery is being fast. If, if your bird flies out the window, but you're also a little bit hungry, make a sandwich. If we're dealing, <laughs> if we're dealing with birds, scan any trees and other obvious perches on your property and surrounding properties. If you can see your bird anywhere, a bird might want to hang out. Here's the <laughs> listen to the. Th- <laughs> birds like trees. Listen, I'm not gonna. We're not going to mince words here. Birds like trees. Look up in a tree to find your bird. <laughs> if you want to sh- find your bird. Be sure to check nicer apartments with open windows. <laughs> <laughs> Listen to this, Mike. If you can see your bird and get it to see you, it may fly back to you. <laughs> can your you bird is at what we would call a decision point. <laughs> The bird's like, can you imagine the bird up on the on the branch and it's yeah. like uh. looking up at the tree? This is my whole thing. <laughs> this then, is my whole thing. And then looking down at the guy <laughs> <laughs> who's like <laughs> Chrissy! Chris, Chrissy! Chrissy! And you're looking <laughs> Chrissy, it's me, the guy who clipped your wings. <laughs> Chrissy, it's the guy who clipped your wings and gives you like three corns a day. Three corns. You tell me you're going to find three corns in the wild? Hey, good luck finding three corns. You'll find two. After everything Maybe I two did. corns. After everything I did for you, I clipped your wings. I it gave was, you corns. It, you have no idea how dangerous it was for me to clip your wings. <laughs> And I learned. I took the time. <laughs> and then as soon as you left, Chrissy, I acted fast. <laughs> Did you see how fast I ran out here <laughs> when I saw that this bird I own flew out a window? Oh. In some cases, a bird may be in shock or be too afraid to move very much. <laughs> they might be in shock for how big the world actually is. <laughs> At first, they can't believe how how big the world is. Well, first they can't believe that the person who feeds them would clip their wings. <laughs> they had a long time and to now, think about that and one. Now they're outside. <laughs> they had plenty of time to think about that one, Mike. The second your bird goes outside, it may be it may be amazed at how big that cage is. <laughs> then it discovers the real cage. <laughs> Then it discovers the cage within the itself. Within all of us. <laughs> the bird also recognizes the cage within all of us. And as luck would have it, we've had our wings clipped the entire time. <laughs> he, yeah, the bird just looks back and goes like, hey, buddy, you're the one who clipped wings. And then he flies off. 
Laser asshole. In his circle. Yeah, around his head. 